Uh, Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Uh, to our uh, senior principal, PA chair, the teacher's representative, the parents' representative, and the parents of the Form 4 2024 in Gagaz. Good morning. Good morning. Hallelujah. Amen. I want to thank God for the day and for the opportunity that He has granted us to see the day. Nashukuru Mungu sana kwa tupeo hai siku ya leo. Nataka kuwashukuru pia wazazi kwa kuchukua muda wenu na kufika hapa siku ya leo. Najua tumekuwa hapa kwa miaka mitatu yaliyopita na sasa hivi tuko kwa mkono wa mwisho. So Bwana awafariki, awafariji na Bwana aendelee kuwabariki. Amen. <laughs> Nimejaribu ya Kiswahili. So the four for parents before I give my report there is just one verse I want to read. I know it's a very common one. Then I say something about it then we can proceed from there. I want to read from the books of Second Timothy chapter 4 verse 7. Second Timothy chapter 4 verse 7. It's a very common one, but sometimes also see it in the funeral. So even here, it can apply to us. And Paul writes this to the young man, Timothy. I have fought a good fight. I have finished my course. I have kept the faith. Henceforth, there is laid up for me a crown of righteousness, which the Lord, the righteous judge, shall give me at that day. And not me only, but at all them also that love his appearing. I am reading that because the form four parents who are here, we have kept the faith. We have been here from the year 20. When was your daughter in form one? 2021 just after Corona. You have been here with us for the last three years, 2021, 2022, 2020. And now we are in Form 4. People, or those who are <coughs> tired, some of them, are no longer with us. And today we are left with a candidature the ones that we are going to enroll at 171. The number that reported in that year, when your daughter reported in Form 1, we had 207. That was the time they reported in Form 1. 207. And I've said how many do we have today? 171. Meaning, some have dropped on the way. And that is the journey Paul is talking about. He has seen it all. When they started with a good number of apostles, as now he was winding up, he was seeing there are very few. Those few who have kept the faith with the Ringa girls are the ones who are seated here. And because you have kept the faith with the school, including everybody in school, we must keep on with that faith. You must only give up. Amen. We must have faith in our leadership here, led by our principal, Madam Miller and Dinger. We must have faith in the teacher as well we have here. And we must have faith in our parents' representative here. That is when we shall achieve. One of the class teachers, Madam Florence, has told us that we can't construct by talking negative. I am a family man. That means I am married with kids. One thing in family is that when every time you keep on making negative comment about your spouse, you kill his or her self-esteem. When you are kama mimi, ni ukweli ama si ukweli. Kama kila wakati iwe kazi yako ni kuongea mama nani umefanya hivi baya, mama baba nani umefanya hivi baya. Hata kifanya vizuri ya tajua tawamefanya vibaya. So how do we encourage one another? We talk positive. 
And that is what you want. This is a new year. This is a new candidate class. This is a class that has never done any KCSE exam. The only exam they have done is KCPE. And which they all passed, that is why they are here. So we cannot go back and look back and say, look at what you have. I know history determines the future. But the future can break from the history. And the church is on path. That is what we must believe in. In Hebrews chapter 3, it says, chapter 11, Faith is what we believe that would happen. So we must have faith that we believe that our girls will do well. And secondly, the reason why we have grace distributed from A plane to E is because they must have somebody joining those grades. Otherwise, they will not be there. To the queen. Yes. And so everybody cannot score an A and everybody cannot score an E. Exams must discriminate. So, leave a lot of pressure on your daughters. Today, there is a lot of pressure. Last year, I was handling a case of a girl who was to sit for class 8 and every time would be called to go and talk to her. She was in a boarding school. But from second term, she was not attending school regularly. Every time she was at home, could not walk because the muscles were twitching. Twitching is minamanesha. Uh, those who are not sure of my mother tongue, sorry for that. Uh, but uh, it's just what we call muscular twitching. Later, we realized the problem that was causing that was anxiety. And the anxiety was being as a result of the pressure from the parents. Muschana alikuwa average. Alikuwa to average student. He used to score around 250 marks up to 280. And the parents would be insisting, next time you come here, you do an exam and you don't score 300, don't step in my house. We can push up to some extent. But there is a writer who wrote this in one of the playbooks called Aminata. He said, you don't expect blood from a guava. So push up to some limit. But let it not go to a limit that breaks down the student. That is one thing we have with parents of a candidate class. Kama yeye ni mutu wa B, encourage her to go beyond a B, at least even a B plus or an A minus. If it's somebody who is average at a D plus, tell her, my daughter, next time I want you to do better in this and score a C plan. But you don't tell her that your brother who is learning at Ringer Boys you scored on the same is scoring a B plus and you you are scoring a D minus. It normally discourages the students. Everybody is unique. Kila mtu ameumbwa kivyaki. One of the books of Chinua Chebe called No Longer Artist, he says, You can describe me. You can describe my parts. You can describe my behavior. But what I need and what I stand for, it is me to do for it. That's what Jimmy says that. So, encourage your daughter and encourage them. We shall also do the same. But if you see it's reaching a breaking point, please hold on. So that they don't cry all the time. I'm saying this because some of our parents will be living here. Then you leave us with girls who are crying, who are demoralized. Ukimuleza mbona unalia kwa class. Ati baba ama mama alisema, nisipopita, nisipopita esabu ni pati C. Hata wae nipaye pocket money tena. Hata wae nipaye shopping. Tuko nao wapa. So, let us find a way. This is what was asked. Let us find a way of balancing the well-being of our students in school and our expectations. That is my encouragement to you. But we must keep the faith. Now, I also want to let you know that this year, 
2024, our candidature has increased, and we keep on increasing every year. In 2022, we had a total candidature of 97. 2023, we had 132. 2024, we are 171. And next year, God willing, we shall have almost 200 plus, 250 on the minimum. So it means we are growing. So be part of that growth. Report forms is an issue. As the Office of Academics, headed by the Director of Studies, we issue report forms. So when you want to attack a bursary, you pick a class teacher or report from a owner, then it shows us that you are a responsible parent or guardian. The first thing that you check on when your student or your daughter reports home is a report form. At the end, you want to be a form one. Report form what na peana mwisho wa mukula. Akuna siku to me back in a report form apa yam toto. Sasa wakati mtoto wako anakuambia tu kupewa kwa sababu huko maliza kulipa karo hiyo ni uongo. Report form tunapeana. Keep them, file them. Good parents normally file their report forms. So that one time you can go through the history, tell your daughter, oh, well, this is how you used to perform. Keep those report forms, file them for institutional memory. Just file them. The other issue is the belt. That is joint exams that we do. Normally we inform you about it. We start it in third term of the previous year. Na njini ya mawa wameka hapa, wameka hapa wote, muliambewa ama mulipigiwa simu na class teachers mwaka uliopita. Ya kwamba watunafunzi wanaenda kufanya mtiani ya joint. Mbawa mulilipa 2000. Mulilipa 2000. Yeah. E, sasa hiyo hiko mpaka term 1 and term 2. Tunalipa 2000. This term, only five have paid so far. Na mtiani inaanza end term. Hii pesa linatumiwa kutafuta mtiani. Kupewa kununua mtiani, kulipa wenye wana, kufanya marking. Because it is not marked here, it is marked jointly. We do it with five schools. If I just remind you, we have Bishop Lena Sokoku Girls, Obero Boys, Ringa Girls, Gotra Teng, Othoro and Wire, those are schools along here. Soon there are two schools, one school that is likely to join us. We'll let you know when you come back next time. Uh, results of last year in our joint exam and term, uh, Wire was the sixth because we are six school, position six. Position five was Othoro, four was Trating, Ringa Girls was position three, position two was Obed Boys. And the best school, position one, was Bishop Lena Sokok Girls. So that is how we performed in that belt of last year. Thank you. Thank you for that applause. It's encouraging. That is being positive. However much we are position three, this time around, I'm seeing we are very close to Obey Boys. We want to beat them. Then we see where blocks is Bishop Lena Sokok Girls. So we want to progress bit by bit. So that where you do your investment, it doesn't go into waste. What am I, where can investment up and I? And I can't be a share and I can eat it. Why is that? You quit. Yes, I say, you'll be a share away. You know, be a share away too. But I'm going to be a killer. Siku, Mutu and buy at a fry in Toto Akipita. You wear him when you're a lipa caro. Now, well, you even your neighbor will not be happy that your sweat has done well. True or false? True. Even your sister, sometimes even your brother. Mm. The only person who can be happy is you and the teacher. It is our business. Normally there's a politician called Lindy Nyoro, the MP for Kihar, who says, we are Africans and Africa is our business. So we are also Ringa Girls and Ringa Girls are our business.